welcome to another Beauty Ninjas Mask Monday. This week I am doing the face shop and this one is the lemon citron, which citron means in German lemon and um, Chinese writing. Um, lemon extract, it's brightening. Yep, there it is. And it's in French too. Mask pour le visage a l'extrait de citron. That means a mask for your face with lemon extract. <laughs> I know a little bit of French. I lived like on the border from France. Like when I lived in Saarland, Germany, it's like right on the border. It's like a 20 minute drive. 20 minute drive down south. Ooh, it's drenched. Oh, and it smells nice and lemony too. I love lemons. And if you drive up north 20 minutes, on one side is Luxembourg, and on the other side is Holland. Well, actually, they're right next to each other. Uh, so, I always have this problem of getting them apart. I was requested to do a, or to try a mask last week in my comments. Um, I forgot the exact name. It's a peel-off mask. I went and looked it up. It's going to take a minute because right now... The holidays around and all this traveling and buying gifts and stuff. $35 for a peel off mask. It's just not in my budget, but I really want to try it because I did look it up and uh, the reviews on it are absolutely fantastic. If I could just fucking remember what it was called. Oh. Anyways, I am so enjoying this new phone. I, I cannot believe it. I will not live without it ever again. So I don't pay attention to the directions. I don't think there is any sound. Like to me, what's what's big to know about a mask unless it's got like a few steps. There's no serum left in there, but it is very drenched. And I like it when it sticks to your face like that. And, and like, I didn't put any lotion or anything on after I washed my face and brushed my teeth. It is like uh, one or two o'clock in the morning. I don't even know. <laughs> But um, that's my life. This is my my morning. This is my breakfast time. This is normally the time I've already been at work for about an hour or two. Okay, so I really don't know what I'm talking about. In this Mask Monday. So um, let me just talk about some plans here. Like in the next few weeks, just, just little shit. Okay, I'm not buying anything from anybody. <laughs> no makeup, no nothing. Um, I did get a new headboard, headboard because, you know, as honeymooners broke our old velvet tufted headboard. So it's on the side of the road ready to get picked up. And I, you know, I got it on a, a Facebook yard sale about three or four years ago. And, um, I got it really cheap. And when I went to go look up a California King or just a regular King headboard on the internet, I could not believe how fucking expensive those things are. So I'm really sad that it's gone. But I did find a new one. And it should be here this week. Um, <clears throat> and it, I feel like the bedroom is naked without a fucking headboard. So we got something. Now we had the one that had the little studs everywhere. Kind of like a diamond shape pattern studs and it was dark black uh it was dark brown velvet really pretty and um but we got this time we got one that goes straight downwards and striped effect and like a gray if i can only talk my husband into because we have like a a lime green bedroom that's his favorite color and um so anyways I wish he would let me turn it into like a oatmeal color and then we can have like brown, black, gold, gray, and oatmeal, like those kind of colors or white around the room, you know, an accent it with a little this and that, but he will not depart from this damn green color. It is so crazy. I mean, you, I have to have the lights off, curtains closed anyways, but you know, it's just everything's green. Curtains are greens. Everything's fucking green except for the furniture. Next thing is, is we got, I believe it was in July. 
uh, we made plans and we already got the tickets to go on the Ghost Hearst Tour, which is a collab with Char's Fashionation called the Sinister Sisters. Look out for that because that's going to be a really good one. Like us ladies are going to go from some are doing their homes, some are doing cemeteries, some are going to uh, certain houses or, you know, just stuff like that. I'm going to go on the Hearst Tour in Savannah. And I hope that I have enough time to get my picture taken with Tracy in front of the in front front of the cathedral because it was a fucking beautiful cathedral. Um, I don't know if I'll have a chance to do that or go to the cemetery, but that's part of the Sinister Sisters, um, and that's going to be on the 29th. I get off that morning and I have to get up and get ready about four, so I made a mistake this past week. I missed a friend's wedding because I tried to stay up until it was time for the wedding at six and I passed out. And when I woke up, the pictures were on Instagram. So anyways, not Instagram, but yeah, one of them was and uh, some on Facebook. Nonetheless, I got her a card with something in it. So, um, so, and then, um, let's see what else, what else are we doing? I am actually off for the first time in six years on Halloween and it's on a Monday. So I'm going to be a witch and uh, I'm going to wear like the one contact to make my skin all ugly and shit and my hands all ugly and white and green. And I'm going to give them, <laughs> when they open the door, I'm going to hand them my apple first. And then I'm going to give them the candy, of course. Oh, I'm so excited. Just like since I've been in the United States, um, this is like the first time I'm actually handing out candy. Like when I first moved here, I moved here in 2009. I moved to uh, St. Simons. Nobody did trick or treat. You had to go to like certain housing areas or um, trunk or treat where people hand out candy in the trunk, stuff like that. But um, no, this year we're actually going to make a glow in the dark sign in the front yard with witches on the porch. And I'm going to sit there at the front door when they. <laughs> I need some kind of doorbell maker or something, but yeah, it's a, too close a notice for that. But yeah, I can't wait to do that. This part is bothering me. Barbara always cuts hers off. Then, of course, on Friday. Is it on Friday? I believe Friday. We are going to be having a collab with the Half Pumpkin Face with me and my friend Beauty and her, more with Renee and Jessica Vargas. And uh, can't wait to see how that's going to turn out because I'm going to do that right after this video. And it's going to be a mess. So I cleaned up my area, got me a fresh new nice towel and uh, get ready for that one. And then finally, November is over. <laughs> Oh, October is so over. See, I'm a mess. I'm going to go ahead and take this off. It's, I feel like when it starts to feel warm and it's not cool anymore, it's done its duties. But then, I mean, I love October, but it's so freaking busy. And not only that, uh, like at work, Friday nights, and this is what I deal with alone at work Friday nights, is they have football games. So I start from 11 and I get off at some time like between 6 or 7 or something and uh, it is just crazy. The attitudes from gas stations are crazy. I think I will do a rant video on attitudes from gas stations. Mm -hmm.